UV sanitizing devices for your smartphone. They are in high demand right now, but do they really work? Rich Jamiro explains in today's text mom. UV phone sanitizers have been around for years, but suddenly there's lots of interest and it's easy to understand why. Today I'm talking to an expert about whether they actually work and the features you should look for. It sounds easy. Just a zap of light and your phone is quickly sanitized. If you're concerned about germs and bacteria, you want to be sanitizing as often as possible. Tommy Galloway is with Hometics. Their portable UV clean phone sanitizer is an instant hit. As opposed to the old UVC bulbs, these are UVC LEDs and they they tend to be a lot faster. The rechargeable device looks like a case. Pop the top, put your phone inside, zip and activate. It takes just 30 seconds to clean each side. Our philosophy was the most effective sanitizer is the one you can use the most often. Casetify makes a $120 UV sanitizer. It promises to zap germs in three minutes. It also wirelessly charges your phone in the process. Phone Soap might be the best known brand in the space. Their $80 sanitizer continues to sell out. It looks like a tiny tanning bed for your phone with UVC lights on top and bottom. We don't have a lot of good data that specifically says people are getting sick from their phones. Professor Jim Malley has been studying UV light for 30 years. He says it is effective. It disrupts DNA or RNA so the organism can't reproduce. And if the organism can't reproduce, then it can infect the human. Studies against coronavirus are still in inclusive. If you buy, Mally says to stay away from UV wands, which are less effective, and look for a well-designed box with reflective surfaces inside and lights on all sides. Or his favorite simple solution, use a 70% alcohol wipe or a Clorox wipe. You can wipe the whole surface, you can get nooks and crannies, and then it, since it's an alcohol, it evaporates fairly quickly. You don't, you don't make your electronics wet. There is one more thing to look for in a good UV phone sanitizer. You want to look for independent test results published on the manufacturer's website. They should tell you exactly how many light cycles it will take to kill various organisms. All right, if you want to learn more about the boxes I showed you, go to my website. It is richontech.tv. I'm Rich DeMiro, and you are tech smart.